friends. All of a sudden, it seems from Winterland comes the first little flowers. So today I would like to present you my photos and uh, videos devoted to crocuses and also tell you something about them which you might have not known and tell you something about these little cute and brave flowers who no matter of weather which is not so warm yet decided to come out and to look at this sun they are so cute and adorable they like just to touch them and to film them and to enjoy them the diversity of their colors is stunning you can see yellow, purple, white ones and others. You plant crocuses, leave them and wait when in very early spring they come up. So they need not too much attention and care, not capricious, but so so sweet little babies. Nothing says spring is on the way better than blooming crocuses. These colorful cup-shaped flowers signal the arrival of warm weather and the blossoming gardens. The first crocuses sighting is always a joyful surprise. Time to go back out in the yard and begin a brand new season of planting and harvesting. While their presence is fleeting, we always eagerly await their return to the following year. So why they are so not afraid of some snow and even a little bit cold freezing wind? This is because their petals are covered by wax cuticle. The word crocus comes from the Greek origin and it means weft, the thread used for waving on a loom. But the Greek uh, origin of crocus extends to mythology, the legend about Hermes and Crocus. Uh, the two friends uh, were throwing a frisbee back and forth one day. And the tale goes that when Mercury aim failed and he struck Crocus on the head, so he had a wound. And as Crocus lay dying, his three drops of blood spilled from his hand and onto the center of the flower. 